Good morning and welcome to Live with Lucky. Happy Friday. We made it, guys. April 28th. Hope everyone is doing awesome this morning. Let's go ahead and get started with our Shamrock Pledge. I'm sorry, our Pledge of Allegiance followed by our Shamrock Pledge. So everyone is focused. We're standing, we're silent. Ready, salute, pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands. One nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Now for our Shamrock Pledge. We are the scholars of Shamrock Gardens. We are dedicated, committed, and focused. We prepare for greatness by doing our best every day. We cooperate with our classmates, teachers, and staff. We respect ourselves and all people. We know that hard work is the key to success. There are no limits to how far we can go. We dream big, believe, and achieve. We will graduate from high school and be college and career ready. We will succeed. Oh, lunch today. The chicken fillet sandwich also known as a chicken filet sandwich. If you get that, you get brown sugar baked beans. They're so yummy. Or sweet kernel corn, or both. Um, if you do not prefer the chicken filet sandwich, then you can get the yogurt, cheese, and granola bag, the plain hummus and sunflower bag, wild butter and grape jelly, and the veggie pinwheel, because those are just limitless. They never run out of those. Uh, fruits, ooh, they've got fresh orange wedges, one of my favorites today, lots of vitamin C, uh, the mixed fruit cup, the strawberry blueberry cup, wild berry flavor, strawberry craisins, apple crisp dried raisins, tropical flavor raisels. So hope everyone can find something that they enjoy on that menu. Today is Focus Friday. And something that I picked that I thought would be really um, awesome to share is about journaling or writing. So do you know that writing stimulates creativity? You know, it helps us be creative and visualize and think of what's happening when we're writing. It helps you calm down. It slows your breathing and it decreases stress. So I have included on here some May journal prompts. Hopefully my face is not in the way. Let me scoot me over here. And um, these are just, you can do them in order or you could pick a number and do them at random, or you could take your finger down, close your eyes, and then stop on one. But um, it has like a recent compliment you got, so you could write about that if you've gotten a recent compliment. Um, are you organized or messy? Your biggest victory, what worries you? The last book you read, the last piece of real mail that you received, who's your role model? Top three favorite experiences, best kind of cake. So just all these different little prompts that uh, just take a few minutes to complete. And um, it just is nice just to sometimes sit and reflect. And um, after you do it, you, you do feel pretty good. So um, if you have a journal or a notebook that you wanna devote just to this, um, you know, that's something you could definitely start doing. Um, and it also helps you become uh, smarter with reading comprehension and your writing. So it's kind of like, you know, a benefit, uh, benefits all around. So uh, journal prompting, and writing is what we're going to what we cover today for Focus Friday. So maybe that's something you want to do starting in May. There's 31 prompts there. If any teachers you want to print out of that, you just let me know and I'll get it for you. Okay. I hope that everyone has an awesome day of teaching and learning. I hope you have a wonderful weekend, and we'll see you Monday on Live with Lucky. Bye bye.